So in this video today, we're setting up the Echo Show 5. What we're gonna start out doing is we are just going to plug it in here in the back. We're eventually gonna start getting a blue ring here that I believe turns yellow once it is ready. Let's go ahead and wait for that. So we have got our blue ring right here. We've got it spinning around. You can probably see the reflection there better in my hand. So we've got a small blue light spinning around. It is loading up for us. So that is perfect. We'll just wait for it to get into setup mode. All right, there we go. Hello, your device is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your Alexa app. Okay, so it did tell us that we need to set it up in the app. So I have got my app loaded up right here. Now you do need this app and you do have to have an Amazon account. So do keep that in mind. We're gonna go ahead and tap on the app and all we need to do is hold it close to the device. We've got our orange ring spinning down below. We are just gonna give it a few seconds here for it to detect that it is pairing. This should be all you need to do. All right, found it. Now we're gonna go ahead and set it up. We're gonna agree and continue. Searching for Wi-Fi. Now, if you already have an Echo device, it will use that same Wi-Fi. If you are setting it for the very first time, you may have to type in your Wi-Fi name and password. Now for me, I already have a bunch of devices, so it did find mine and it is connecting our new device here to my home Wi-Fi. Your Echo is ready. Perfect, so we got connected. I'm gonna go ahead and click on continue. This is gonna give us some things that we need to know, some additional features in here. We'll click continue on that. I'm gonna select English for my language. Now, what room do I want it in? This is kind of important later down the road, but I definitely recommend putting it in the room that you're going to have it in. For me, this is going to be the office, so we're gonna click continue there. Now you can set up a voice ID so it can recognize if you're speaking to it or if somebody else is and it can give you custom things like maybe your calendar, stuff like that. I'm gonna go ahead and skip that for right now. Yes, skip. Where is the device? Yes, that is my address. So we'll go ahead and click OK on this. Now, welcome to Sidewalk. This is essentially Amazon's feature where you can share your Wi-Fi service with devices around you. Not only just your own devices, but people who are maybe walking by your house, other people who you may not want to have access to it. For me, I leave mine disabled, so I'm gonna go ahead and click disabled on that. And then we're ready to get started. Now, when I click let's go, it's gonna run through a bunch of different things for you to talk to the device, how to work with it, things to say to it, just to kind of get familiar with it. But essentially, that is how you're going to set up your Amazon Echo Dot. Now, once it's set up in the app, you have the option of clicking on devices down here at the bottom. If you don't have a lot of devices, you'll probably see it in your list right here. But because I do, I'm gonna go ahead and click on this drop down, select my devices for Echoes, and then I'm gonna click on apply. It's just gonna show my devices, and then I need to scroll down here and look for my new device. Ah, here's mine up here at the top, so I'm gonna go ahead and click on that. From here, we can click on the little gear icon up on the top. We can go into all of the different settings that we have right here. If you wanna rename it, you can edit the name right up there on the top, but this is going to give you an idea of all of the different settings if you wanna dive deeper into those. Well, great, now that we've got our Echo Dot set up, what can we do with it? I have created a separate video on absolutely everything that you can do with your Echo Dot. So be sure to check out that video for more details.